I'm getting ready for the gym right now. I'm gonna have to do like a quick, like 45, one hour workout max because I have to go. <sighs> it's good enough. It's gonna have to do because I'm not gonna do that again. <laughs> I don't like to go to the gym without like any makeup because I feel like ugly. If you look good, you feel good and lift good. So I'm gonna do a little something. I currently don't have a gym bag, but that's okay. I'm just using my old backpack. My outfit, I have pink shorts on and a brown shirt with that says Goose Law and has gooses on the back. Hello everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be taking you guys along on a day in the life of a 17 year old nail tech. I'm 17 years old and I do nails and I'm out of school. So it's currently like 10.30 right now. I am disappointed in myself. I had my alarm set for 7. I don't remember turning off my alarms at all. I guess I did. So now it is 10.30 and now I'm rushing because my first nail appointment is at one. Both of them are gonna be like house calls so I'm going to them instead of them coming to me. We only do it for my sister because she lives like 20 minutes away from me. Um, it's a 10 minute drive for me but it's supposed to be like 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna take you guys along throughout my whole day, a little vlog and just bring you guys along with me. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you guys about my creepy neighbor. Everybody has a creepy neighbor. I watch a lot of true crime. I'm always listening to like true crime podcasts, always watching it. It's like very entertaining to me. So I'm like always like looking out. I like to be informed. And I kind of grew up watching like horror movies, loving all of the Saw movies. Sorry, don't mind Stuart right here if he gets in the in your face. The other day, I was going out um, because I was gonna do a quick run to Walmart to buy a cat litter for my cats. And I come across this neighbor and he's like, hey, all in Spanish, he's like, he only speaks Spanish. So he was like, hey, like I, I just got these new security cameras and I want you to, the, to install them for me. And I'm just like, oh, like, I don't want to say yes because I've already heard creepy things that he has told my mother. And once, one time he told my mom, oh, like, I made a hole in one of my walls so I can keep an eye on you and your daughter. What the, what is wrong with you? Even if that's a joke, that's not funny. That is not funny. Anyways, he asked me, oh, can you install my cameras for me? Like, I don't know how to do it. It only came with English instructions, which I very much doubt because I have had security cameras at my house for many years now. But anyways, he was like, oh, like, I want you to come to my house and install them for me. And I'll pay you $50. To like someone it might be like nothing but after all the things I've heard before and just like the way he told me it's just so creepy like no like I didn't want to say no because I didn't want to like I don't know upset him I don't I don't want to say I didn't want to upset him but you never know like you never know with these people so I just I was just like okay 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 and then my mom came out and he asked her oh so is she gonna do it and I said, hell no, I'm not doing that. I'm not going to I'm not going to this man's house after everything he said, after everything he's done. It's not worth it to even go. Yeah, I'm here. Hope you guys you guys liked my creepy neighbor story time. <laughs>
tell you, I had one of the best workouts I've ever had in my life. You can tell. You can tell. I did some goblet squats um, to target my glute, I mean my quads. And then I did some lunges. And that's about all I did. And then the, obviously the treadmill for like 15 minutes. 11.34, so I gotta get going. All right, everyone, so I'm all ready. I didn't wash my hair because I was just gonna put it in a ponytail. Need to hurry up because, oh girl, we are running at a time. So see my little nice little setup right here? I need to destroy my setup and I need to bring everything that I'm gonna need, which I pray to God, I do not forget anything because that would be bad. Oh, y'all. Oh, my legs. Ooh. I know you guys heard my knees crack. I know you heard my knees crack. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna fall. While you watch me destroy my beautiful, beautiful desk right here. It took me 15 minutes, but I did it. Here's my table. Oh my gosh, it looks so empty now. All my bags. Okay, now I have to do a couple trips, bring it to my car, and I gotta go, y'all. Okay, guys, it took me a while, but I got everything loaded in my car. I picked up my sissy, and we are here at Dollar Tree. We got here at Dollar Tree, and we're gonna pick up something, a little something, something. And she said she's gonna get me a snack. Okay, we're in Dollar Tree and I found some pink ribbon. So I'm buying this because I'm gonna put little bows on everything now. A pink heart. And then I'm gonna get her a pink flower. And I'm getting it again, guys. Pineapple flavor this time. Flower. Oh. Hi, I'm gonna do a bowl. It's gonna be with rice and orange chicken. Thank you. Could I also get teriyaki sauce? Hey guys, so it is currently 9.30. And I finished um, like a while ago. I just been cleaning everything. I put everything back in bags so I can take it home. Um, I will show you guys, let me show you guys her nails. This is how her nails came out. Little coquette, little coquette vibe. Um, so this is how her nails came out. Right now she's making little ribbons on her little purse for school. But yeah, like I said, I've packed a lot of my stuff already. I just need this table and then my armrest, but this is, I'm not going to pack this. These are, these two are separate. I'm just munching on some hot Cheetos right now. And I'm going to get ready to go right now. Both nail sets came out super cute. I really love them. I need to organize all of this back into its correct spot. So I'm gonna start heading home just in a little bit um, and I will catch you guys when I'm home. Peace. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Yeah, thank you for the set. Mm -hmm. You teach. My biceps are a little sore. Ooh, they love me. Really good. Yeah. Just a few to snack on, you know, a little road snack. Hey guys, so it's currently 10.30 and at last I'm home, finally. But not too happy because this is what I gotta do for the next 30 minutes. Can't focus on me. Baby, can you focus on me? Time check is 10.53 now, and I just finished putting everything where it belongs. Um, so, let me show you guys. 
Okay, so here's an overview of what it's looking like. It is a little bit messy because I do have a couple things out right now. But here I'm setting up clean utensils for um, for my clients. I have this where it belongs, this paper I was using just now. <laughs> um, and then this is just um, the utensils and some barbicide for a few minutes. And then I got all of this stuff back. It looks a little messy, but you know what? It's fine. I just finished separating my um, my laundry and I just have, I'm gonna rinse these off and go ahead and dry them so I can put them in their little boxes. Okay guys, so I finished making these little kits. If you guys are curious what's in here, I have a nail clipper, a nail nipper, a nail file, a cuticle pusher, and then a little uh, mandrel drill bit, like a, a little sanding band. And then I have that in both of them. I'm gonna continue cleaning my room a little bit just to like make sure it's like nice, you know, clean room, clean space clean mind hey guys so it is currently almost 1 a.m and i am just waiting on my laundry to finish drying but i'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready for bed thank you so much for watching and coming along with me on my day i'm very tired and i have to wake up really early tomorrow so i will catch you guys in my next video thank you for watching